Welcome to my seance. And while I'm talking to spirit using the spirit board, I'm going to answer one of your questions. One of you asked a great question that was, what do I think of spirit boards? What do I think of Ouija boards? Well, inherently, I don't think they're good or bad. It's how you use it. How do you use it properly? Let me give you three tips. First and foremost, always ask for protection. Ask for your guides, the Archangel Michael, any other guardian angels, anyone you want to come in and protect your portal. It's like calling in the bouncer. Secondly, after you call in the bouncer, don't just invite anybody in. Don't stand at the door and say, hey, anybody out there? Anyone want to come in? You never know who's going to step in. Rather, ask for your highest and best, your loved ones to step in, or you can call someone in particular. Say, hey, Grandma Ruth, you out there? Hey, Uncle Bob, you want to come in and chat? And they'll probably step in. Thirdly, once you're done, say goodbye to the spirits, but then also say goodbye and thank your guardians, be it the Archangel Michael, your angels. Thank them for standing watch and ask them to close that portal. If you're a little worried that something might still sneak in, lastly, a little bonus tip, put a piece of paper or a piece of cloth between the planchette and your spirit board. That cuts off all communication. So that way nothing can get in. That being said, thanks for your question, and I'm going to be answering another real soon. And I'm going to get back to seeing who might be stepping in and what spirits might have to say something to me tonight.